Spanish. Sorry? Well, I, I had to occupy my time, right, when I was away for a year, so I had to. Uh, yeah, another 90 minutes. I think the most important thing is that we we were able to uh, to play through fatigueness. Uh, it's been tough the last three weeks. Obviously, it has to be like that. And um, I think the most important thing is that people come out 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 of these games without injuries. Um, and we just build up because um, the season is just around the corner, and we have to be ready 100%. Is there a sense that it's going to take a little bit of time for the players to come together and gel properly? And it's maybe going to be another few games before you've seen the best of the team? Look, uh, through fatigueness, it's hard to judge anyone. Um, so tactically, technically, um, I think the, the most important thing and the focus of everyone was to uh, get, fit, get fit as soon as possible, um, go through these games without injuries, and uh, first day of, of the new season, we're already uh, in, all, in all aspects. So I think that's the main focus. Yeah, you're talking about fatigue a lot, and the manager was talking about pushing the players, he wants everyone to be fit by the start of the season. Has this been one of the, the hardest pre-seasons of, of your career? And if so, what's, what's been different this time around? Because he seems to be really pushing the players. To be fair, yeah. Personally, I think it's been the hardest preseason uh, that I ever um, um, ever had. Uh, but I think it's a good thing. Uh, you know, you grind for three, four weeks. Um, you push yourself to the limit. Um, obviously, uh, you have to also understand your body and accept that sometimes you can't uh, go over the line so you don't, uh, don't get injured. But I think everybody did a good job until now. And uh, look, we have another 10 days until the season starts. So... Um, I think we're in a good place uh, mentally because uh, it's not only physically in preseason, it's also mentally. So I think we're in a good place. Um, but we know season starts, uh, it comes to uh, down to results and winning. And um, I think everybody since day one, uh, especially the new players that came in, understood that. And um, obviously the old guys, we're already here for, for a few years. So we know, we know what's, um, what we'll what to expect. Avoiding injuries and opponents of that. Given what you've been through in the last year, did I explain uh, the reaction at the end when you got that tackle? No, no, no. It's um, it has nothing to do with my with my injury. It was just uh, a poor tackle that uh, it was unnecessary, and I, and I told the guy it's a friendly game and it's un unnecessary, and you don't have to do that. But. Um, in terms of injuries, I think um, we're in a good place considering other pre-seasons. Um, so, um, yeah, individually, I've trained in uh, every 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 session. I ran uh, in all sessions, so I can't be happier with with myself than than I am right now. I'm I'm confident, and um, yeah, uh, it's been it's been obviously a year and a half. So I, it's it's been quite a quite a long time uh, since my injury. So I I don't really look back. Has preseason been big for you, just in terms of getting your physical back after coming back and not playing as much as you liked at the tail end last season? Yeah, no, hundred percent. And look, last season coming come, coming mid season, um, you know everybody it's at a certain level physically, and I'm basically starting at zero. It's so hard to catch up uh, physically throughout the season because there's there's not too many running sessions. There's not sessions. Uh, we play a lot of games, so there wasn't really time for me to, to catch up with the, with the guys, so I, I had to accept that sometimes I can't play. Um, but uh, obviously this is a different story right now. Uh, I've started everything uh, with, with everyone. I had just 10 days off. I was with the national team, so um, I came in full focus, um, physically, mentally, everything. I'm, re I'm in a really good spot, so um, I can't complain. Given the amount of new attackers that have come in, how would you describe the challenge of trying to become a first pick? Uh, there's no difference since, um, I don't know, since the age of seven. Um, I fight with everyone, whoever it's in front of me do doesn't really matter, so it's nothing new. You've been playing a wee bit deeper, is that a role you enjoy as well? Yeah, a lot. Um, I think when I came uh, into Rangers, um, I could have played just the, the um, top three positions. Um, I, I've added this into my game since two seasons ago, um, obviously afterwards. Um, the injury came, so I couldn't 
um, actually play in that position too too much but my mind was always there I knew I could play there I had a few questions in my mind that I answered this preseason and I'm happy about that um, so I have no problem in playing deeper I like it I'm more on the ball I have three runners in front of me so yeah, I'm happy it's got 10, 10 days now to the, the first competitive game where do you think the score is in terms of being ready for that first match um, well probably just 10 days away from being too full fitness <laughs> <laughs> thanks guys thank you guys